Hi guys, this tutorial is on the Home Inspector Pro mobile feature lists. Lists are drop down comments that you can have within a narrative and allows you to have multiple versions of a narrative within one. Uh, you can have multiple lists within a comment as well. So in this example to show you, we're in exterior areas or exterior walls. We're going to go into our windows section and right now we have the uh, the comments set up to show one, one row per comment and that can be changed under settings which we've discussed in another tutorial. Um, the, in the first narrative we see these um, less than and equal to brackets. Those signal that there's a list in there. You'll see right here it says a window at the front rear left right. That's the name of the list and the word rear is the default value of the list. Uh, and then it says of the home window issues and then the default value there is cracked. So if we were to do absolutely nothing to this comment except select it, right now it would say a window at the rear of the home is cracked and that's it. To change the values we're going to click on the list button or tap on the list button on the bottom. Uh, this is on an Android device. If you're on an iPhone or an iPad the list button is a little bookmark icon that's on the top. That's the only difference there. So at the bottom we have uh, two spin wheels. The left spin wheel allows us to select between the two lists. So we have the front, rear, left, right, and the windows issues. So if I'm on the first one, I can choose front, rear, left, right, side. And you see that the text is automatically updating within the narrative. And then now I can switch to the second list and I can change the value right there as well. So right now it says a window at the left side of the home is cracked and I want to change that to say has pest damage or sorry has water damage and I'm going to close the list save and now that comment's updated and I can select it to put it inside of the report. Uh, notice there that when we were in the narrative we had to actually click on that list button to make that come up. If you use quite a few lists you can actually go to your settings area in the mobile app and there's a comment there that says auto list pop-up and if I enable that and make sure to save if I go back to my comments and edit that comment you'll notice that the list box automatically popped up which saves me a click um, and that's a feature you can easily turn on and off the lists themselves are edited over on the desktop and there's a separate tutorial showing how you can add and edit your list easily. If you have any questions on this, please let us know. Help at homeinspectorpro.com. Give us a call or just click on the help desk on our website. Thank you very much.